when you take a bite of this lamb, it actually takes you to Greece. Love the mate. Yeah. I've always wanted a black car with mate. <laughs> Have you seen it in English, mate? Matt. 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 Oh, Matt. Matt. Okay. Mate. <laughs> sounds better when you say mate. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? Good. You smell lovely. Thank you. It's my favorite. It's my my Sasha Fierce perfume. <laughs> so where are you taking me today? We're going to Santorini. Normally, I either go Saturday or Sunday to that area at the beach. So after the beach, we just go to Santorini. It's our go-to place. My father is really picky with food. He's Italian, of course. And this is one of his go-to spots as well. Nice. Plus, the staff is very friendly, very attentive. And the food is amazing. That's another thing, because here in Miami, there's a gazillion restaurants. There's a lot of competition and sometimes you're like, how is this restaurant even still working? You know, because right. the service is bad, the food is bad, the price is insane. Right. But this is one of the places that, that's also a why it's a local go-to because the price is very reasonable. The food is always spectacular. It's Greek, so it's very light and healthy, you know. And Oofa. The, Oofa. Yeah. <laughs> this place is amazing. It's very it's just yummy. Like right on the beach. The music, the music is always chill, nice, a very nice vibe. Uh, they do get, how do you call it, like exciting to put it that way? Sweet. <laughs> Hi, how are you? My name is Divya. I am Santorini's chef. And this is Danny. So he is another chef. We're gonna prepare something for you guys and you can see with us what we do here usually every day. Thank you so much for Thank in you. inviting us into your, your home really and sharing your family with us. Thank you for coming. So we are blessed to be in Miami Beach one of the most beautiful spots in the world. Yes, my father grew up in the restaurant business. My grandfather, his father, had already a restaurant in the island where I come from. It's in North Greece, a small island called Thassos. I grew up as a Greek boy with a father who owned a daily and a Greek restaurant. After the school, throwing my backpack in the corner and start helping and work. And I always say to myself, one day I want to go to the United States and open a restaurant. And the dream came through. Wow. up in the kitchen, so I respect working with a Greek father those years, very strict. And working hard always, so that's a good thing because if you work as dishwasher, cleaning restrooms, need to know to bartend, need to know to cook, need to know to serve, host, everything is helping you to understand and appreciate your team. And for me, the customers are the most important. This is how we grew up in Greece. We have a world, world called Philoxenia. Philoxenia is you cannot translate in English. It's a Greek word, but it has to do with warmness, invite you in my home, give you the best hospitality, because I love to. Yes, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. It's very important, it's very important for me that the team loves what he's doing. Here, everything is spectacular. As you see, oh, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is uh, the ingredient. So, uh, practically in the island I come from, we have farming, fishing, uh, olive trees, good olive oil, wines. And I believe good cooking comes with the ingredients that you are using. It's very traditional Greek as well. 
That's what I like because here in, in America they like to Americanize things sometimes. New York has a lot of Greek diners that they are New York guys type in Florida. And when people come, they are telling us sometimes, oh, that's not like we get in New York, but yours tastes better. I say, we are trying here and we keep it original. Like when you go to Greece, you will eat the same way. We are really blessed and I'm very thankful the support of the neighbors and locals. Yes. Yes. And we give something back, and you know we have, we are known to have the best happy hour here. Happy hour? <laughs> it's amazing happy hour. Miami. It's actually one of the best in Miami. Right. The Miami Spice Menu. Yeah, yeah. $25 a very good lunch. Yes. Fish plates. <laughs> Appetizer, main course, and dessert. The baklavas, the best. Welcome to Miami. Yes. <laughs> best happy hour in town. Best happy hour in town. We have a choice for over 30 tapas and we charge only five dollars a plate. Oh, that's that's a yeah. that's, that's un, a unheard of in South yeah. Beach. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's just amazing. It's pretty good. But I can tell you a traditional dish in Greece for holidays is roasted lamb. Ah yes. So most holidays we are cooking and it's also very known Greek mm. roasted lamb. Yeah. You need to know what type of lamb you are using sure. and not to make it too complicated. We're just using garlic, rosemary, fresh oregano, olive oil, and we like it lemon, lemon uh, tasty, the lamb and with Greek lemon potatoes. That's a traditional dish that we cook in Greece and I love to cook it because you need to know it's very important the time that you need to cook it the temperature and how to cook it yeah yeah and the lamb's always spectacular here as well you should know that valentina this was her first choice out of all the restaurants in miami I get goosebumps. But yeah she said she I'm said this is <laughs> this is where we want to go first and we so need to things. make a opa for valentina <laughs> luisa bring me a plate to break <laughs> <laughs> that's our tradition in greece when we love someone we honor and it we we honor and break something valuable for love uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> For Valentina. Thank you. 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 Only grape that comes from Greece, yeah. and you taste that grape and a bit of like a Pinot Grigio on the back, which is exactly what you taste. Oh, that's amazing! Let's dig in. Let's dig in. Super good. But did you get any dressing? It's amazing. It's so simple, it's but the simple flavors you taste like every like the feta, even the lettuce, like the lettuce itself actually has like really great flavor. Mm -hmm. I mean like everything is so fresh. Wow. See what I'm talking oh, about? Oh yeah. That might be the best octopus I've ever had. I, I didn't know octopus could be that consistency. It's yep. just like, it's like soft and melts in your mouth like that. Exactly. Is, yeah. Here they do a spectacular job with the octopus. Oh my God. How do they do it? <laughs> right? He's right. I mean, it's like you taste the flavor, but you taste the shrimp. You taste mm -hmm. the ingredients behind the flavor. It's, it's amazing. Wow. <laughs> Here we are. This is amazing. Mm. 
Mm. He is so good. Oh my god. Wow. This makes me happy. <laughs> well, Valentina, thank you for showing me Santorini. This place is amazing. You have to check it out. Thank you. Did I win you or fell you? You definitely won me. Amazing. Cheers. Another good venue. Absolutely.